so cloud, PSN we referred to earlier, uh, data centers, there's a whole sort of underpinning layer that is the platform that is missing from the anchor point of this document. To be fair, it doesn't look published yet. Well, that's it's pretty common knowledge of Jeremy, isn't it? And also, we're wondering whether uh, there needs to be more uh, counting on that I think the, um, the web of things <coughs> is another kind of, yeah, how, can, how could government use all the embedded stuff? I mean, it's probably a bit early, um, <coughs> but it's, it's certainly direction is something that will need to be done. Um, I think in terms of the role of people and what people, people need to make this work, um, is another, another, I mean, it's a short paper, so we can't cover well, it. Well, citizen capabilities, or what do you mean? To, well, in terms of, A, building on the kind of co-creation thing and how to, what is the role of people in that and in, in co-creation, and also um, how government can enable that more. Um, <clears throat> and then I think the, the other um, thing is kind of almost around the analytics and how... Um, <clears throat> What, should, what, what opportunities are provided by analytics and by the opportunity to analyse all this, uh, this huge amount of data that could be set free. Um, and then the final one, which <coughs> we kind of touched on, we, well, we haven't touched on, is, is quite a, a key theme in the paper around the holistic approach to things and so on, but how to actually make that work in practice. It's kind of, it's what's been talked about for the past you know, 10, 15 years. And we're still not making a lot of progress.